Mass Mutual has hired a chief diversity officer that is a senior executive within the company to further our inclusionary efforts within the LGBT community. They created a, a pride group to specifically work within the LGBT community and they are involved in many of, of the local uh, programs and uh, pride events that take place in all the different communities around the country. Whether we have domestic benefits available for everybody that is involved with our community, that's from the corporate structure all the way down to our local level, so our agents also have domestic partner benefits available. I get that question a lot when I'm interviewing people. You know, do you have domestic partner benefits? And absolutely. And I'm, I think initially when I would get that question, I was kind of like, why are you asking me? But uh, I've, I've had it so much, it's just like natural, of course we do. And, it, and to the individuals that are asking me that, that question, it's a big deal. So apparently they're getting in the community a lot of no's. I don't know how you exclude one person over another because of any of the things that we've talked about. So to me, it's natural to these, these companies that don't do it. I don't get it. It's kind of like robbing a bank. I would never rob a bank, so I don't understand why a robber, you know, what's going on in their head to do that. So it just doesn't make any sense to me why that wouldn't just be standard practice. Well, Ma Mass Mutual as a corporation is extremely honored to receive this Barry M. Goldwater Award, and it, and it really reflects the longstanding efforts of their inclusionary practices and focus on the LGBT community. If you work for a company that is not involved in all the different um, ventures that are out there. I think it takes away from your ability to diversify, your ability to serve the people within the community that you're working in. And if we didn't have that type of openness and that ability to do whatever, whatever was in the best interest of the community and the people that we're dealing with, it would, uh, it would severely hamper our ability to grow our, grow our business and, and help everybody. Please welcome from the Dollarhide Financial Group, Mr. Jeff Dollarhide.